good morning or afternoon, wherever you are. We're very confused with the time, even though it's one hour time difference. But we are halfway down La Rambla in Barcelona because we decided this year again we would go on a week cruise because frankly it's one of the most cheapest options that there is about to be honest. Um, Oh, forget the free food and the drinks as well. Free food, free drinks, so you really can't complain. We are going to take you along with us on this cruise and then we're coming back to Barcelona for four days um, and meet up with Rachel and Jacob. We're just on board now, having a wee look, which is quite exciting. Um, lots of different places for food, which I think Graham is starving. Yeah. Absolutely starving. Um, it was best though. But Graham was like, why is your card different to mine? And it's because mine says welcome back. And then Graham just says welcome to. But I think it's going to be a fun week. Um, seeing where everything is. Getting to go back to our favourite ports again. Oh, the, oh my god, the escalators. I've never been on a ship. This is the first for me. A ship with escalators. A ship with escalators. Oh, sorry. Hi. Yes. Hi. We just kind of seen our room. Hilario. Hilario. Yeah. Hello. Ooh. Yeah, it's nice. So. Oh, it's a slider. Okay, so. Toilet. And then the shower. Which people complain about all the time on Cruise Critic that the bath, that the toilet and the shower are separate. But I actually think that's a great idea. It's saving because room, isn't it? it's saving room, yeah. and how often is somebody in the shower and you're like, oh, just need to go for a pee, <laughs> you know? So it's now time for the ship to leave, and there was meant to be a huge sailing party, and then it had to. Pouring it down it was. So it's now just completely empty. But a few people in a few hot tubs. So we had a great idea to get a great time lapse shot of you know the sun and going out of the port. And now we're having to settle for sticking it outside and getting some hopefully good time lapse shots in the kind of drizzly rain. Good morning. So I decided not to film much last night to be honest because I just really didn't want to, but we thought that we would just go eat some breakfast because we are at day at sea today and just kind of see what's happening and then just chill on the pool deck. <coughs> And we met a lovely couple we ended up from charity bus, which was fine. Um, and they were from kind of like down Cambridge way. Yes. Um, and of course we had to get topic, topic and the topic of how many cruises we'd been on came up. Which then led to me giving them all the train times for how to get to Port 
it's fun. I know, I know. Um, so it's a lot of fun. Um, well, we learned the tip with breakfast. Have a look round and see what there is first before you just pile your plate high and then you're too full and there's still stuff that you want to try. But I guess that's what we've got the next six days for. We have been waiting all day to go on the biggest flight that there is on this ship that you have to go down on the ring because they said it was too windy. We've literally just finished eating our lunch, put our husky back on and now they're letting people go down it. And if you haven't read Me Before You, which is a film coming out soon with the guy who was Finnick in Hunger Games and... Amelia Clark. Yeah, who's on Game of Thrones, then I would definitely recommend it. I'm already on page 234 and it only started being it this afternoon, well this morning type thing. Yeah, we have drinks and everything is good right now. Soon I will be free